You know, um, when it comes to doing what we do every day, uh, which is analyzing uh, politics and, uh, of course, uh, personnel from uh, the Trump administration, um, what's really important is accuracy and, of course, timing. Here is, just days ago, <laughs> Boris Epstein, the former Trump advisor, campaign official, who is now at Sinclair Broadcast Group, which, of course, Sinclair made a deal for good campaign coverage of the Trump administration, and just coincidentally ended up getting a huge waiver on their FCC license to have uh, 70, 80 percent clearance across the country now for their local television. Boris Epstein is on 80 percent of the country. I think Boris Epstein has greater clearance than MSNBC does across the country. And uh, here he is just days before, unfortunately for him, Anthony Scaramucci was, well, screwed the poochie. Here it is. Changes are afoot in the White House Communications Department. It may be hard to keep track of who's in, who's out, and more importantly, Little what did this he know. means for the American people. Let's break it down. The president wanted to bring in a fresh perspective to help manage and communicate the White House's message. The reins of our communications are now totally in the hands of Anthony Scaramucci, the new communications director. He's going to report directly to the president. Sarah Huckabee Sanders has been promoted to press secretary after having been the principal deputy. I know Anthony hey, personally. He's a good friend. He's unquestionably passionate and direct. That's been pretty obvious. He also has a high level of respect for media, having been a part of it himself. The reason his appointment matters is that there's going to be a new approach to dealing with the media from the White House. Anthony has already made two key promises. First, cameras are on for the daily press briefing. Get ready to see more of those pointed exchanges between the White House and the press. Second, the White House comm shop will now enable the president to speak directly to you through all mediums, even more than in the past. This will allow for the president's words to cut through any spin or interpretation and go right to the people. The bottom line is this. There's not always agreement between the White House and those covering them. That is impossible. What these changes do signal, however, is there will now be a better working relationship between the White House and the press. This will hopefully result in us getting more thorough and real information on the issues that actually matter to our daily lives, such as jobs, health care, and taxes. Don't piss down my back and tell me it's raining. So he was, um, in addition to sort of being slightly premature on talking about Scaramucci changing things, um, he also was basically implicitly blaming uh, Sean Spicer and uh, Reince Priebus, I guess, for, um, well, I guess not Reince Priebus, he didn't know at that point, uh, for all the disinformation that comes out about the Trump administration. It's a great fucking commentary. <laughs> Wait, hold on, one fucking... I'm fired. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Such my, a uh, my fucking wrong. He's such a trust instantly trustworthy uh, message deliverer. Boris Epstein. <laughs> Hold on to one second. I need to finish commentary quick because I have conference call with human trafficking ring that I also manage out of Moldova. It's Ryan's Priebus, or as I call him, Rince Penis. <laughs> This is joke me and Moochie do. Oh, he fire? Okay, what the fuck? It's Sinclair. Who's next? Who it doesn't matter. Who's next? John Kelly is going to bring strong new... Oh, he fired too. Okay. Well, that was the beauty, actually. I mean, Kid you could Rock play. is going to you could roll. really enhance personnel in the White House. You could roll the first 30 seconds of that. Yes. For the next person. Just use same <laughs> beginning package, and then I'll come in with new B-roll, transparency, B-roll, blah, B-roll blah, 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 B-roll bullshit, over bullshit, my bullshit, saying bullshit, name. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. B-roll over my saying name. <laughs> Just yeah. use picture, I say name, we don't need to shoot it again. We have B-roll. <laughs> Hi, uh, Mr. President, you won't get involved with new cargo container of women come from Ukraine? <laughs> Hi, folks. Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube ads have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL, and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.